Hello beautiful and amazing people, I'm Ito Mitra here from Kampala, Uganda, East Africa. I hope you're all doing great and I hope that God is protecting all of you. Today is a beautiful Saturday afternoon. It's currently cloudy. It's actually threatening to rain. I'll be showing you how the outside looks like, but I am planning to go somewhere. I'm actually in a rush. I'm hoping that the rain does not affect me. Dennis, Nzija. That's my Buddha guy there. He's waiting for me already. So I want to rush somewhere and I want to take you guys along. Recently, okay, not recently, I think three months back, my cousin's sister reached out to me and told me, you know what, Amito, come. I opened up a, a saloon stroke parlor. I wanted to come and we give you a free massage and uh, pedicure, manicure. But then the Amito inside me was not okay with that. I feel like we are all hustling. We are all trying to work hard and uh, there is no need for us to get free things. We have to work for whatever we get. So I thought like it would really be unfair of me going to Hapala and having free uh, services. I needed to pay for these services. So I have been dodging her here and there. Why? Because I didn't want to get free services from her. So this week has really been so bad for me. I am so stressed mentally. And it is so funny how when I'm stressed mentally, it affects my whole body. I currently, for the past two days, I've been feeling my body is so painful, so stressed. Imagine, I've not done anything that makes me feel pain all over my body but it is just my mind that is making me feel this way so i feel like i need a massage it's been really long since i had a massage i think it's been three to four months if i'm not mistaken yeah i want to go and have a massage and guess what uh, i talked about um feeling feeling like having a massage and one of my very close friends sheila said no amito just go to any spa get the massage that you want let me know and i'll pay the bill you guys i'm super excited so i decided why not go to my cousin sister's parlor and get this massage and also do a little showing of her parlor and saloon to you guys i'm sure you guys would really want to support her oh my god i'm talking too much i didn't mean to do this i didn't mean to talk too much but i just want you guys to know where i am coming from so i'm going to support my sister aminata in uh, Bukoto, it's called P and A Pala, and I'm super excited to support her. I mean, not if you will be watching this video, I just want you to know that I wasn't avoiding you. I just, I just didn't want to come and and and, and not pay you. You know, I don't want free things. We are family, so we need to support each other. And for you to know, I love you, and I wish you well in your business. May you prosper. May God give you more and more clients. So, guys, without wasting any time, my border guy is already waiting. Let's go and support Aminata. I'll also be taking you through my massage. I want a full body massage because I want this body to be so free and ready for next week, you guys. Meanwhile, I am feeling so bad because I washed last evening. Unfortunately, the clothes didn't dry, others are there. The clothes didn't dry and it is cloudy. I cannot leave them outside because I'm not even sure that uh, they will dry today and the fact that it's going to rain there is a high chance that I might go back to zero when rain falls on them I'm really feeling bad. I hope they don't start smelling and I'm also praying that it shines tomorrow so that they dry pray for me you guys and I really feel so bad because that will mean that I'll have to wash them again Anyway, uh, let's go. I'm all wearing green today my cute little bag is green and then my top is green and then my legging is also green so let's go <laughs> So guys, I am finally here. This is P and A Beauty Parlor and Spa. It is opposite uh, Trinity Primary School, Trinity Primary School in Bokoto. So let's get in. Let me first pay my Buddha guy, and then we get in.
Sometimes I wish my daddy was hit So I could get a little hold of what a daddy could give I saw my dreams fade in the streams Of the dad running for the house side on the streets Sometimes I wish my dreams were real I would have been a little different in viewing me I saw my hopes fade in the streams Of the dad running for the house side on the streets He had a bomb me even if you brought me roses My grandmama told me every day I know And it took a little longer To truly appreciate who I am And stop holding to illusions that can hold in my mind Should I have seen it Sitting on the sea so the world keep on turning around Till you hear a bingo They tell my body God I wanna know him more He told me to be humble So he could let me know He had a bomb me He had a bomb my clothes in so I am already in the massage room guys and uh, it is too cozy yep so it's about to get down Up on my story, and up on my glory. It's all about you. You brought me this far from nowhere. I give you all the glory. You deserve much better when I know this. The running back to my roots in the first lane. Hoping you could have me on the same day. Gracious, nice, no scared. They was looking at me saying that I'm so fake. And we've been rolling many years on a this way. Press a little hard with no games Cause I know where I'm going at no stress Sometimes I wish you were sitting right beside me I would definitely be the lady shoulder with the crying It's a little bit of me, it's what it takes And I'ma leave the rest to God, he knows best It really doesn't matter if my life is boring In your eyes, that's the only view of his glory Come and dwell in me, Holy Spirit Cause you made my eyes see clearly He had a bone me up on my clothes, and up on my story, and up on my glory. It's all about you. So, guys, meet my sister. Hi. <laughs> so, she is the owner of the place, and um, yeah, say something. Yeah, you guys should come and support. We are located at Trinity Primary School, just near it, like this. You find us, we have the best services in Uganda. She has experienced it and she'll tell you your whole experience. So, guys, please come and support. Tell us everything you have. We have massages, we take care of, we have makeup, we do your hair, we have officials, we have everything that you need to make you a very beautiful bride. We mainly concentrate on brides, though you can also come in, but mainly brides. So, we can host you for our. We also have rooms, accommodation for brides, so you can also come and. And reside here like yeah, you're a experience, night. Yeah, mm -hmm. experience the whole thing. So it's easier to work on you in the morning than us coming and moving around. We are always at your service. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. I had one of the best experiences. Really? Ever. Thank mm -hmm. you. The massage was top notch. <laughs> Thank you. That's what you always do. We are good at massages, you guys. You should okay. come and experience. She'll tell you. Of course, you guys already know. I would, I would, I wouldn't be talking to you guys normally if I'm not happy. I just disappear. Exactly. But now, I think you guys can even see that glow. See how I'm glowing. So guys, come around, come and support. We are ready to receive you. Sure thing. Yeah. All right. See you guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> guys, I just came for a massage, but 
it happens to be a bucket night as well so let me show you what happens here unfortunately it's late in the night so the video might not turn out the way I want it to but this is it so I'm not at you host like parties or something yeah, we also host parties baby showers birthdays name it Any bridal showers like bridal showers we host uh, wedding meetings mm -hmm. anything even we can host uh, any meeting that we need okay to, to, to all right. When does this happen? Bucket night happens every weekend mm. from Saturday, from Friday mm. to Sunday, mm. from nine to nine. Oh, wait, nine what? Nine a.m. Okay, to nine p.m. I thought nine p.m. to nine p.m. to nine a.m. Yeah, we can also do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we shall be waiting for you guys. They'll be here. This far from no way I give you all the glory You deserve much better wanna know this Now you got a testimony and I say it's binding you So let the world know what the Lord is doing in you Hi, today is another beautiful day It's currently 5pm Sunday evening And guess what, I feel so lonely I've been feeling so lonely the whole day and um i don't know if this happens to you guys as well but then some days i totally feel lonely i feel so alone ah <sighs> today is one of those days so i've decided that i'm not going to kill myself in bed let me just go to the nearby to the nearest bar stroke lounge and just sit there and you know watch people listen to music and maybe sip some tea you all know i don't take alcohol I only take juice and tea and once in a while some sweet red wine because doctor says it's good for our hearts so i just want to go there see what i can sip on as i watch people happy i know most times the people who go to that place are like happy have going to have fun so i just want to to go vibe with them like just watch them you know when i watch people happy i also become happy so i want to take you guys along and i might walk it's not very far it's actually far okay it's it's like uh, it's like five minutes drive ride on a border on a border border eh on a border guy on a border border so I might walk for around twenty five minutes yeah let's see how it goes I just want to show you around I hope my shoes let me walk that long if not I'll just grab a border and get there okay so let's go let's go and chill so we are here. What can I ended up leaving home very late? It's currently um eighteen twenty one. It's almost um almost seven. So let's work together. Do you guys remember this place? Remember that video I did around here? Do you guys remember the video I did there? I found some babe there and I tried to ask her for transport and she totally refused to give me. <laughs> Comment down below if you remember that video. These are like the nearest shops around this area. So guys, this is the area where I stay. This is like, like a simple trading center around where like people buy um sell things where we buy things, Kale. Yep, yep, yep. It's currently oh it's 6.25. This is the famous Mukade's place. So this lady is like um I don't know, but she's like not a witch doctor. She's like a local herb seller. I see people going there to buy herbs. Yeah, it's called Mukade's place, Mukade. 
I stay in this village, guys. This is my village. I think I'm going to spoil my shoes. It's high time I got a border. A border, border. So this place, this place is known for selling goat's meat. It's called Kumbuzi. <laughs> ah, when was the last time you saw a plantation, a banana plantation? There is one here in my neighborhood. Okay, there are so many, just that it's this one that I've captured. I say in the village, literally. Village life is better than town life. Do you remember those debates at school? So now I think I need to get a border around here. I'm tired already. Baby girl is tired. Baby girl is very tired. So guys, I'm finally at La Venti. The Venti Hotel Bar and Restaurant. So, let's go, let's go, let's go. This place can park on Sunday. This place can be something else on Sunday. <laughs> 